20 years is a very long time in a sectorized dynamic as aviation. In 20 years, there have been a number of challenges, failures, successes, tragedies. But what has always amazed me is our capacity to adapt ourselves to the new challenges and to the new world. The sense of achievement and the team spirit were great. And the team spirit is still great today. I'm really proud to be part of an organization that is barely 20 years old and that has so many firsts in its name. The A380 was an important project for the agency. It has been the first major certification completed fully under agency responsibility. And therefore, it marked really the transition from the GAA to IASA as a capable certification authority. The IASA way I would describe as inquisitive, critical, and collaborative. Most of IASA activities require cross-agency teams that work together as well as with external stakeholders. This type of cooperation is vital for the success of our mission. IASA, as the agency of the European Union, is also cooperating with international partners to ensure the highest level of safety at global level. That EASA is a truly global player is evidenced in many fields, but not least in the field of continuing airworthiness approvals, where we do inspections of maintenance organizations, maintenance training organizations, and CAMOs all over the world. And I'm truly proud to be part of it. I have always been amazed by the fact that in each and every technical topic, we can find at least one expert in EASA. And this is valid not only for existing topics, but also for innovation, for new topics on which we are always on top of the game. That is the guarantee of success in order to enable safe and sustainable aviation for the future. In addition to safety, we have promoted interoperability and efficiency in Europe's air traffic management network at the local, regional and global levels. Accidents are uh, unfortunately still a part of aviation safety, but uh, working together with industry and uh, national authorities, uh, we have uh, far fewer accidents than in the past. Working for safer and greener aviation sometimes means making tough decisions and saying no, even when the commercial stakes are very high. Of course, not everything goes to plan. However, what I find reassuring is this culture of a constant improvement and thoroughness. Yes, we do have quite a few rules because we work partially with taxpayers' money. But we are not bureaucratic or slow at all. Our stakeholders also expect speed and efficiency. We help and listen to our internal and external stakeholders, big or small, and together we form a community. I find it endlessly fascinating to see how together we manage to bring safety to the next level. I feel that I'm making a difference and the skies are safer. As a team, if you have solid arguments and if you take the time to share them and discuss them with stakeholders, in my experience, eventually you end up getting acceptance and buy-in. And to me, that is a sign of a healthy community working towards a common goal. I've been working for EASA since more than 17 years and I can say that not in a single time I have been bored in what I'm doing. I think it's fascinating what is going on. We really accompany the development of aviation I believe that your background and nationality do not play any role at this agency, just as aviation safety has no national borders. Despite being at the forefront of technological development, EASA places people at the center. I just love the diversity of our colleagues and stakeholders, and I really believe this is a strength. Environmental sustainability has been at the heart of the agency from day one. Reducing engine emissions and noise has been part of the original remit of the agency. And already back in 2005, we had an environmental week at the agency. The aviation sector is going through a green transition, and EASA wants to be a leader in facilitating this transition. EASA is a key EU agency that implements environmental policies for aviation, and even more in the future. The future of air travel will be more using uh, new vehicles such as drones, flying cars or air taxis and electrical aircraft. We have reacted timely and we have developed a regulatory framework that will enable safe integration and operations of this traffic. 20 years later, we are now recognized as one of the world leaders in aviation safety. We are passionate about aviation and your safety. Your safety. Your safety. Your safety. Your safety, your safety is our mission.